Alright guys, so if you guys haven't noticed already, uh, if you guys go to the new section, there's actually going to be a promotion event now going on for both burnt cheese as well as fettuccine cookie. And that is going to be starting or has started already uh, from October 27th all the way up to November 3rd, uh, which is going to be uh, most likely when the next update is going to be dropping, which is going to be on a Friday, it seems like. Um, so if you guys uh, go and check out the gotcha right now, uh, the banner for burn cheese is going to be uh, marking the end of the promotion event while fettuccine cookie is still going to be you know uh, available within the feature gotcha uh, so burn cheese of course is going to be replaced by the new epic most likely that will be coming out and uh, fettuccine will be the second banner uh, that will disappear along with uh, the next cookie and it seems like um if that is the case, we're going to have less than about three weeks uh, to pull for the new cookies. Uh, but, you know, that is going to be announced uh, later on. But in this video, I want to talk about uh, these two cookies, especially uh, burnt cheese as well as fettuccine, because they are both absolutely amazing right now, guys. So uh, let's kind of just go over the uh, rewards here real quick. So for burnt cheese right now, you guys can see that it is going to be uh you know the the normal stuff that we get the magic cookie cutters as well as the exp star jellies but this time around it's going to be a 30 minute speed up uh that we have as well as time jumper uh times 50 all right uh so we do have that for burnt cheese as well as for fettuccine it is going to be exactly the same except the uh other extra reward is going to be 100 topping pieces as well as treasure tickets uh if that even matters to you guys but for anybody who's wondering if you guys really uh should be investing or you guys should be pulling for these two cookies i definitely 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 recommend you guys to actually pull for these two uh these two are absolutely amazing you guys have already probably seen a lot of videos uh, that i have posted about these cookies especially someone like fettuccine uh, i have uh, shared comps with uh, fettuccine as well as the review video and you guys can tell that fettuccine's uh, skill honestly is absolutely broken for an epic like like this cookie is really really good now uh, not only does she have a taunt which you know allows uh, enemies to target her instead of your other uh, cookies like your dps like golden cheese you know black pearl and someone like that uh you know uh, the biggest thing that sucked about taunts cookies were that they did not have any self-sustain or they really lacked those self-sustain. However, for fettuccine cookie, she has all of it. She has the ability to, uh, you know, gain damage resist passively for every HP lost. Uh, and on top of that, she's able to do healing and her healing is absolutely insane it's bonkers guys um and you guys already know if you guys have watched my review video and if you, if you guys have watched the arena videos you know her healing is crazy and on top of that she is able to you know do extra earth type damage uh she's able to do some decent amount of damage as well and uh she's also able to decrease uh attack as well as attack speed of enemy cookies all right uh so it's it's really really good and i will have to say that you know uh she's going to be worth it especially for players who do not have crimson coral all right so you know it, in reality for most of the free to play players with the amount of crystals that are being given out i usually do recommend to pull about up to if possible three star uh but good luck with the the gotcha because for me it was not that great and you guys can see that i can now finally promote her all the way up to four stars only uh but on the other hand uh burn cheese all right so burn cheese is uh, going to be also amazing right now of course uh he is going to be a little bit more of a you know um a single target kind of support tank uh, that we have going on and i mean by single target it means that uh he's really going to protect one particular cookie right uh the one with the highest attack and that cookie is really going to uh be protected by burn cheese right not only does uh he uh have the damage focus to absorb 50 percent of the damage that receive uh but also on top of that he's able to provide himself as well as that cookie debuff immunity for 12 seconds which is almost 100 percent of the time right 100 uh, percent uptime and um on top of that if you do have golden cheese he pairs really really well with golden cheese uh to have that 
you know, damages this as well as the, uh, you know, in case she goes into her sarcophagus, uh, the attack as well as attack speed uh, gain as well. In my opinion, uh, if you guys really have the pool uh, and you guys have to promote, it's going to be burnt cheese uh, because burnt cheese, these stats do matter uh, in my opinion, uh, especially the defense stat as well as HP stat to tank more damage. Uh, having that stat boost is going to be good. So the extra promotion is going to be good. But for Fett Fettuccine, like I'm versing you know, uh, high ascended, um, high promoted, uh, you know, like golden cheese, crimson corals and black pearls. And even with the three star fettuccine, it was perfectly fine. Uh, and she just is absolutely just amazing. Uh, although her stats, overall stats just may not be as great, uh, as someone like, you know, other cookies that we have. Uh, but her just overall self-sustained damage resist and healing that she has is great so she doesn't need as much promotion as what i would say like other cookies to actually make her work inside of the arena um so definitely uh you know both of them are great for arena fettuccine uh, especially is also great for pve just because of the taunt self-sustain again and additional to that again uh the ability to you know have an immortality uh, decrease attack, attack speed, and on top of that, if you do uh, get to the you know kill off three enemies, right, you're also able to heal your cook uh, teammates as well. So which that usually only happens within something like a Gate Alliance as well as the World Exploration. So you know I definitely recommend uh, pulling for these two. It's gonna be a tough decision, but uh, in my opinion, try to pull for Fettuccine at least. Uh, get it maybe up to like one star uh, if possible. And then, uh, like, go for burnt cheese a little bit more, I would say. Um, and then, maybe if you want to decide on whether you want to pull for more or not for fettuccine, you can decide that after, you know, the new cookie comes out and kind of just, you know, uh, let go of the uh, promotion event bonus because it's, it's a little bit. It, I don't think it's really like super worth it to like dive all in and then use all of your you know resources to just gain few extra uh you know cookie cutters uh, but just wanted to kind of share with you guys that information just because of the fact that these cookies are absolutely amazing uh it's been a while since we had you know two epic tanks right that came out uh, because after crimson coral was uh released after pataya was released after holiday i uh, got the buff no other real like t uh epic tank except maybe like werewolf as well as t knight were really used now, Walberry's magic candy just kind of flopped, in my opinion, as, as a magic candy. Walberry himself was really, really good, but the, uh, you know, the magic candy was not that great. So, in my opinion, this these two epics are absolutely amazing. Um, and kind of excited to see what the next one is going to be. Maybe it, it will be Olive. Maybe uh, they might do something for us and they actually might release, you know, uh, someone like mozzarella as an epic but we'll have to see but let me know down in the comments below what uh, promotion as well as ascension uh, you guys have for these two cookies and uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys all on the next one